camera's going again. Glenn's behind the camera, and I'm John Hall from Loose Creek Guitars with another little quick tip. Uh, super glue has been the godsend for anybody who works wood. It is a wonderful material, but it does have some quirkiness to it. Accelerator, which can make super glue work even faster, can cause you some issues. Activator, when used on super glue too quickly, will cause a reaction which will actually foam up. So if we were doing a crack here, and I hit this with super glue, and I hit it real quick and too soon, you're going to see that all of a sudden, whoop, there it starts foaming up. And as a result, you don't get a clear coat. Now sometimes, and that, there it goes, you can actually see the, the reaction. Right there, see how it's all foamed up? That's something you really don't want. So if you're going to use super glue, and you want to avoid that kind of a reaction, allow the super glue 15, 20 seconds. Let it try to start curing on its own, and then just give it a light spray, and you can actually see the difference in the reaction time. This is all foamy, this solidified, and you'll see in the still photograph the quality of the two different reactions. And again, it's a little tip from my shop to yours. Uh, keep your fingers off the super glue. Uh, otherwise, one little thing, keep Q-Tex fingernail polish remover in your shop at all times. It's very, very good at getting the super glue so you can get your fingers off of it. Uh, it's awfully embarrassing when you're going into the drugstore with this stuck to your hand and asking you if they can help you out. So, my shop to yours. Thanks again for your support.